yes guys today is a new video um i've been seeing a lot of comments you know commenting on my videos and joining my live streams which i do do on saturdays if you want to come and join make sure to you know subscribe put your notifications on but a lot of people commenting on how they're experiencing a lot of fps drops on fortnite i've been experiencing this, this as well since i've just upgraded my internet i just want to say it won't work 100%. It won't work for everyone. It will only work for you know some people that um, have this kind of router uh, and the speed of it. So, for example, if you know you have a 2.4 gigahertz router, then you know it won't most likely work for you. Um, if you have 2.4 and 5 gigahertz in the same router, then this will definitely work for you. It's worked for me. Um, even GeForce Now has you know shown it on their website and every time you test your network on g4 settings it says that on there as well i'll probably provide you guys with some screenshots and stuff like that so you know what i'm you know saying the truth so before you guys dislike the video because it didn't work for you i'm literally just telling you a warning that's not going to work for everyone it's just going to work for some people um so let's just get into it obviously the first ever step is the schedule i would say the schedule works best um, this is the first like you know option i would say schedule is a big thing because um sometimes you'll get a dodgy kind of server that is only capped with 75 fps and for those of you that are on the free founders pass or free pass sorry um, are going to experience this a lot that you're gonna have to wait a long time and then you get a 75 capped pc um server slash uh, geforce account um and that's have made you want to restart so if you're you know playing in early morning you can restart faster uh late night you can restart faster the second step or option is the main one um the first thing you want to do is go to geforce now settings which i'll probably you know uh, most people already know where it is just go on the geforce now settings i might show a video of me doing it all in the clip uh, I might not but everyone knows what the geforce now settings are um next to one of the applications let me go and click it up um on the top it'll say server location that's your server location there what you need to do is press test network once you press the test net for network i'll show you what comes up on my screen uh, before i did the steps um i'm gonna tell you about um it says my wi-fi connection and then it says 2.4 gigahertz and when i was playing on these servers i was lagging a lot i'm telling you i was lagging because i would put 144 fps as my cap but i'd get around 60 fps when i'm playing arena or creative with my friends um so what you want to do is if you know that you can change um, from 2.4 to 5 gigahertz um on your router and you know that it's a split channel which means um, if your internet connection is good, then it will use 5 gigahertz. If it's bad, then it will use 2.4 gigahertz. So 2.4 gigahertz uh, router slash the speed slash um, range and stuff like that is for better internet, more stable internet. Um, whereas 5 gigahertz is more about the speed of the internet and less about the range. Um, so obviously 5 gigahertz will be needed do uh, with an ethernet cable would be better i don't use the ethernet cable so it should be fine for you guys depending on where how far like the router is from you and your laptop or computer um so what you want to do if you don't know how to just you know dominantly change not dominantly that's not that's a bad word to use but if you don't know how to change uh, your router from 2.4 gigahertz to 5 gigahertz constantly uh, on your laptop um, you can just search some ways on YouTube um, just type in how to change um, from 2.4 gigahertz to 5 gigahertz obviously if you don't find anything then you can just comment down in my video if you don't know how to do that I might even make a video on it in the future or I might link you with some stuff or if you want to go for a less sustainable way, way where sometimes it'll split into 2.4 sometimes you'll get 5 gigahertz if you want to do that then just make sure to restart your router once you've restarted your router, open up GeForce Now again and reset everything and then press test network. If it changes to 5 gigahertz, that means you have more, like, you know, better internet, but less range. So your frame drops will be a lot less. Um, 
and yeah you'll just get more frames better graphics you won't have much lag um, and this, this has helped me if it doesn't help you i'm sorry again um there are other ways to get better fps on geforce now but currently there is a mess up between fortnite and geforce now where there are a lot of fps drops even with the 2.4 gigahertz which i used to play on so you guys will have to do that kind of research if you want just normal ways to increase fps you could just try use my settings again i've said this a lot a lot of times on my stream and yeah that's all I, i've got today with you for you guys it was, it was a quick one because a lot of people were demanding for it i didn't want to make you guys wait too long um and yeah that's that's all i've got for today um so basically let me wrap it up what you need to do is go from a 2.4 gigahertz router slash signal to a 5 gigahertz signal um it will basically give you more faster internet uh, it will basically unlock some kind of thing where um, you can get better internet and it can go through walls and it won't stop frequencies from things like microwaves and stuff like that but if you want to research more on that go for it um and yeah before i end it off i just want to say thank you for 500 subs and i'm i'm trying to get to 1000 subs now that's my next goal um and if you want to you know join my streams with your questions and stuff like that i do streams every saturday uh, maybe sunday mostly saturdays um and yeah just follow all the socials in the description um trying to get to 1000 subs so make sure to subscribe um if it did help you out if it didn't help you out you know you might have to do some more research i'll, I'll do try to do some more research i also have some other videos on my channel which could help you so go for that and yeah thank you for watching make sure to like subscribe and comment thank you